Western Mass News is your local sports authority. A quick change of results for the UMass men's basketball team after a big win in the second round of the Atlantic 10 tournament. The Minutemen suffered a double digit loss today in the quarterfinals. Western Mass News reporter Kayla Burton spoke with the team about what this means for them moving forward. Tough to come off a dominant 100 point scoring game in their first matchup of the A-10 tournament to the very next day suffering a loss to St. Louis. But despite the disappointment, the Minutemen tell me they're proud of how they carried themselves amid all the adversity this season. It was a win or go home. <laughs> I, had to, I had to leave everything out on the floor. I had to do what I could. Disappointment from the University of Massachusetts men's basketball team feeling confident coming into the quarterfinal game of the Atlantic 10 tournament after their dominating second round win over St. Joseph's. But a different result the very next day, suffering a 14 point loss to the St. Louis Billikens. The rebound difference, 45 to 22. I mean, they, granted, they got a lot of big bodies and they got five dudes going to the glass every possession. And we just, we were just watching the ball go through the air. That's just the simple, simple as that. We were just watching it. Fighting to keep them in it, star sophomore Trey Mitchell put up 30 points on Friday. He tells Western Mass News despite the loss, he's proud of his teammates for handling all the adversity thrown their way this season. It was a lot about your, your mindset this year because so many things changed this year. Like we're, we're getting ready to go on the road and boom, canceled done 15 days can't even can't even leave your room 15 18 days like it's, <clears throat> there's just a lot of mental toughness that required to get through this season not to mention having to stay off the court after UMass students were responsible for spreading COVID-19 on campus forcing everyone to stay home I think three three or four pauses that's that's 40 plus days of just sitting in your room doing not allowed to do anything so just it was just keeping that mindset the whole year. And though it wasn't the result he nor any of his teammates wanted, Mitchell says heads high for everyone in that locker room. I can't be proud of the way these guys have persevered through all the adversity we faced this year, honestly. Now, today's loss does make it difficult for the Minutemen to make an NCAA tournament berth, but it's not completely off the table. As for the Minute women, they have their shot at the A-10 tournament run starting next Thursday against St. Joseph's. In studio, Kayla Burton, Western Mass News.